I'm here at Lake Tyres having a fish today. The target species is black brim. I'm gonna start off with soft plastics, see how that goes. If not, then we might swap to a hard body, but let's go and find our first spot. Woohoo! Just found some fish on, on a real nice drop off. <clears throat> Landed one on a soft plastic. So we've just <clears throat> come back out again. And just sit, I'm gonna sit just on that same depth. I mean, it's about nine foot of water. Just gonna work the lure back off the edge, down where we sounded them up. See if we can catch some. Get some more. out there they're just hitting my lure as it's dropping those little ones you can just feel a little rattle on your lure I don't want one of those to rip. Though, because where there's Taylor, there's generally some fruit as well. So, and we know we've already caught a few here this morning, so we'll just keep going. Hopefully, not lose any lures to the Taylor while we're catching the fish. We're trying to get a fruit. Oh, there's a. I love the sound of the drag. <laughs> this is a nice brim. He picked that lure up off the bottom. So that tells me that I need to make sure that I get that lure on the bottom every single time because that's where they're feeding oops and he's taken it right down his gob cool that's a nice a nice brim I'm really happy with that I'll um get the hook out and give you a look well, here's the nice little brim that I just caught. He measured 36 centimetres, so um, he, that hook was right in his lip, which is great. So I'm going to put him back to swim off. That brim came out of about 15 foot of water. So we've actually gone, gone a bit deeper. Um, they weren't working on the edges, so I've just gone a bit, you know, that bit deeper and got one, so... I'm getting some information now. They're deeper. I've got to make sure that that lure is on the bottom because they're going to pick it up off the bottom. Um, so just taking my time, nice and slow. These all these clues as you catch fish or see them on the sounder build up, and you then you can keep them in your memory banks for next time. I get asked quite often, how do you fish a soft plastic? Well, I'm fishing for brim, so I want that lure to go as far away from the boat as possible. We're in the deeper water, so I'm casting away from the bank. Once I've cast, I'm gonna wait for that lure to hit the bottom. I'm watching the line, and I can see when it hits the bottom, I'll get a bow in the line. So that's great, but lure's on the bottom. Then you just need to work it back to the boat nice and slowly, a nice gentle lift, the lure comes up like that, it swims up, the tail moves, then it swims back down to the bottom and hits the bottom again. And again, watching the line to make sure it's on the bottom. Then do that all the way back to the boat. Repeat. That's a nice solid fish, this one. Oh, no. Oh, God, it just dropped it. That was such a good fish. 
Oh! <sighs> Not happy, Jan. I knew there was going to be a fish on this point, and uh, uh, painful, very painful. Yes, it's a nice brim. Yay! It's been a while since I've caught my last one, so <clears throat> we did a move to a favourite spot of mine, and. Yay, it's paid off. <laughs> soft, same lure, soft plastic, just different spot in the lake. Oh, a nice one. Nice little one. Let's put that head up into the net. Swim him in like that. How cool. He's just taking that in the lip. We'll get that out and measure him. We're doing a comp with the Nicholson Angling Club, catch and release. So we take a photograph and we send that off to the app um, and then we release the fish and everything gets tallied up by an independent um, person who run the, runs the app. It's a really great um, sustainable way to, to have fishing comps. All right, we'll put this one back. Gorgeous fish. Look at that. And he'll go off in a shot in a minute. <laughs> I love that. That's probably almost my favourite part of fishing is just releasing those fish, washing them swim off like that. Really good. Love it. Check out this gorgeous Lake Tyres black brim. We've had a tough day. We've caught them few and far between, but when we've got them, they've been all right. We've still had a great time and I'll catch you next time on the water.